And I, why are we doing the intros? Hey, I am There's no back. need. <laughs> it's been an hour since returned. you guys did this. Welcome I wasn't back. there. And we had to be And listen. I wasn't Our there during the beginning portion of it. This game's this Which game's is one way you guys already shit. did this. Yay, you like puzzles again. Tales of shitty coding. This game's come this game is God Tales of it. Arby's. Why the fuck is this the only Tales port that shit? So you should power your PC with Arby's. Oh, it'll never crash. So you just Let's stuff an RB sandwich into the monitor? That's exactly. You need to stuff your RB's burger onto the hard, onto the monitor. And you're gonna, your heart you're gonna drive. give your just PC whatever you do. You're gonna give your your PC cholesterol though. Uh, well, well, as long as it works, it does not work. It doesn't. Well, at least it doesn't give you diabetes. Yes, it does. The dust is diabetes. Because my sister is a nurse practitioner. And she can call out your BS. Oh, I didn't know your sister Shit. was an MP. I hate, I hate nurses. Try to hook up well, once and she dumped me. Well my well my elder sister is. But my but my other sister is working on becoming like a nurse practitioner. Mm -hmm. Uh, Jay here, uh, already mentioned this before, but several of my family became nurses. My I think my brother nice. tried to become a nurse Most once, of my parents uh, had nurses. Stopped doing that. Most I, of my parents my, had nurses. We, we all have a nurse. In our My in our two family cousins life. became nurses. Yeah. I think we're talking we all have about a nurse this in actually. Our family. Like, I am pretty damn sure we brought this up at some point. Yep. That's, that's I think repeat. so, yeah. <clears throat> up and up the stupid turkeys <clears throat> we go! Is your model active? Let's get yeah, started! Active. Why? Yeah. Just asking. Is not moving? No, we're just not seeing it. Oh, that would be why. Why is it every time I stream I always forget to do something? Because <laughs> you are a shoe. Shoo shoo. So la da 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 Don't worry, I'll give you a head pass and cap and settle oh, into this. Oh, that bad. Screw it, I'm just removing Sheena's axe, that's... <clears throat> living sword and living doll. It kinda look- that bear kinda looks like the one Bridget has. Kinda. It doesn't have red eyes. That's it. I was just getting started. <clears throat> you know, it's sassy. You're going down. Because of her rare Ultra Lord collection. Oh my God! You know, Estevez. Eventually, Sheena became so popular that they added the new Tales of spinoff, and it's Sheena, where she, where, where she now resides there. The part of popularity. Spear. Get him! Don't bother me! 
White Spear. Don't bother me. Don't bother me. Get him, bicycle. Get him, bicycle. Water laser. Kratos is one of those people where I feel like internally he's like, Look at me! I'm so cool! Sonic White Spear! White Spear! <laughs> That's it. Mm -hmm. I was just getting. Uh, yeah. I don't know if you can hear you. I don't know if you've been saying something for the past while. I've, I've been saying but, something, haven't I? I've been, I've been hearing, but I just like constantly quiet. Yeah, I've been speaking. You guys been hearing three. I, can you hear us? Yeah, I, I'm talking. No, I, no, I was asking Jay. We're all talking. Yeah, I'm talking. Okay. I'm talking. I'm talking as well. Dude, I'm not hearing you guys. I'm not sure if Jay, if I, if you can hear us. Yay! Yay! Yes. Here comes more of them. Um, Yay! Ah. Uh, 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 Jay! Jay! Happen! Wait! Up, up, up! I don't know! Papa! He's mute! Oh god, what's going on anymore? Mute! You guys not hear me now? I can hear you! We can hear you! We can hear you! We can hear you! You right, can is muted. hear me now? I <laughs> can hear you! Yes! What's <laughs> going <laughs> on? I can hear you! Jay, <laughs> I think your headphones or whatever you... Okay, 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 okay. let's second. establish who can <laughs> hear each other! Okay! I can! Maui, I... can you hear me? Yes! Oh, can you hear me? See, that means yes. Panna, can you hear See. me? Yep, I can five hear you. Five by five. Okay, can... we have established people can hear me. What's going on? Uh, Jay is, I think, I don't know what's going on on Jay's end, but Jay keeps claiming he can't hear us, even though we can hear him. We, I can hear anyone. And they're just like scrambling around. Yeah, but he I couldn't hear it out. Hey, how many fingers am I holding up? <laughs> One, and it's the middle finger. <laughs> no, it's not the middle finger. <laughs> I'm holding up three. I'm holding up two fingers, which is three fingers, but it's two in between the gaps. What? Anyway, I'm safe. I'm saving before we do this fight again. <laughs> yep. <laughs> I don't want to do this puzzle all over again. Yeah, 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 I am sorry, but Jay just gave me ammo. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, let's go fight the you giant. Ammo. Let's go fight the giant and you fire. unicorn. Yeah, yeah, I'm straight, straight to your butt. <laughs> straight to your butt. <laughs> straight to, straight to well, me, and straight to your butt. Straight to your butt, into your system, and through your mouth. Got it. 
Got it. Oh my as goodness. Well. Oh my goodness. This is this. This has been nothing but in windows. You, you said you get. I gave you ammo. Well, I got explosive ammo. You... It's not I helping your. It's not helping your case. Let's just not continue. These when people are watching, shall we? Yeah. Let's just let's just put this to rest and put this thing to rest. <laughs> sure. sure. Eventually, you'll realize that they're not the only thing that will be arising. Something's gonna arise, and it's not the shield hero. What's gonna arise? The Hammer. Hell Hammer. Here, Bunk. Jay, did you know that Colette was gonna have a stronger version of the Pow Hammer called the Great Fall? Uh. Is this leading up to something? No, it's an actual unused attack that crashes your game if it's used. When I heard the name, the I just thought it would've been like a passive where she just randomly trips like in one of the Smash Bros. games. As funny as oh, that yeah. would've been! No, she doesn't. Either that or Colette has been practicing the single strike style. Well, I think she's been we practicing the style one. of going through people's- going through walls. It's, it's the style that it's the style that Urshi, that one of the Urshi foods use. Yeah, single strike and rabbit strike. You know what? Now that I think about it, with the whole Colette not feeling pain thing, I kind of feel bad because that me that meant that she was going through people's walls and she doesn't and she didn't even and she doesn't even feel anything about it. Did you just I go through walls like a cartoon character and not easy. feel any pain? Bitter, she bit her tongue, but she doesn't feel a thing. I mean, I accidentally did that once, like, right after a disappointment. Oh wait, if she, feel if she doesn't feel anything, if she doesn't feel any taste, what if she starts cooking and that's too much of the, too much of the same spice? Okay, so her. you mean like, so you mean like she becomes taste blind? Yeah. Well, kind of, but what if she- what if she starts cooking, and that's too- and, and adds too many of a spice, without realizing it? Uh, who opened the emergency valve on the propane tank? <laughs> and kill! And kill dead! He's gonna descend from the heavens of propane right now! Well, that was a big leak there. Oh, Hank Hill, summon down to give me good propane tank. No, oh, I will. Oh, I will ascend. Almighty it. Hank Hill, I will give, us, give us thy ability to kick some ass. Hank? Bobby? The moon. It's the moon late. No, it's Peggy! Peggy. Holy shit. I am Peggy Hill. I won a bunch of bottle contests. I was I was a substitute teacher. Okay, bye. <laughs> that's, that's why I didn't <laughs> call me the substitute her. teacher. I come and go. She just said, she just said peace out. Oh, am I on? Yeah. Uh, okay, oh, no. let me get dressed really quick. Uh, yeah! <laughs> <laughs> uh, that's what, that's uh, just Oscar. Hey, it's Hank Hill. Chosen hey. one, I'm totally... I drank this purple juice, and I'm so high right now. <laughs> what, what, and what? Here, I'm gonna hey. vomit over you 
down. Hey, Thank you. Hey, you I'll, know I'll what? Accept You're your fucking sick. We're going to use Lloyd's divine feet to kick you in the dick. Good to know. Thank you for vomiting over me. Blar. We have finally done all of the seals. So next up is the Tower of Salvation. You mean, I thought it was, well, I guess, Regeneration Salvation. Are yes. you sure you're not going to use Lloyd's divine feet to kick him in the dick? He can kill the because I have now. a feeling that he has that a long time coming. Don't don't worry, Hank Hill is gone. He went back to he went back to Texas. Uh, uh, uh. Sacrifice is a tech that we will never ever be using because it sucks. Essentially, it can attack everybody and heal everybody, but Cola dies while using it. Oh. Well, that sucks. That just causes more problems. Which is why we shall never ever be using it. You're gonna well, like, we shall never ever have her use it. Yeah. Hmm? You mean she exits the game? She doesn't exit the game exactly, she still sticks around. Like I said, you'll see, I'm not going to give away any spoilers. I, I meant that as a figure, as a figure of speech, by the way. Sacrifice, sacrifice, sacrifice. You're gonna regret this. You know, when I came up, I was, I was concerned. I thought this was some kind of foreshadowing. Uh, <clears throat> I know what's gonna happen to Colette. She finally li she sh she finally listens to Kratos and start eating some Arby's. Too bad it's been too late, cause she knows that she can't taste anything. Why can't yeah, Colette become? Matter. Why can't Colette well, become Colette the? Home... Yeah. Why right. can't Colette become the angels of Grey Garden? That yeah. would have been less. That would have been less painful. I think she has Why not be born ha that way. Why not be Charlie's angel? All right, let's go. <laughs> <laughs> I'm glad you got that joke, Anna. Yeah, up? that is unfortunately a a uh, advertisement series that I have seen many, many times. What? Hey, wait, Charlie's How angel? Many, many times? No, you, you were saying that you uh, <laughs> born that way, and I clipped baby into the bleep. Yeah, there, there's a, there was a, in the 90s and I believe 80s as well that Maybelline Cosmetics brand did a lot of advertisements that ended with the tagline of maybe she's born with it, maybe it's Maybelline. Hmm. Oh. <laughs> yes, I missed it. Yeah, commercials during the 80s and 90s were a breed of its own. If you're not watching the Super Mario Super Show, you'll turn into a Goomba. Ah. Uh. Also, go to hell before you die. That's all, kids. Wahoo! Wahoo! It's Wahoo. me, Mario. It's Mario me. It's me, Chris Brat. Man, I've been right. Luigi. I've been. I spent hours stopping on Koopas in my own original arcade game. Mario, if you can't stop on Koopas in your original arcade game, you'll die if you stop on one. M -m Mario. I don't give a fuck, Luigi. We, we Mario brothers will keep on trying. But Mario, those Koopas don't even slide. You'll break your legs. If we count the original Donkey Kong arcade, there's not even Koopas. I think. 
Those barrels. Um, but Mario, Koopas do exist. Believe me, I stole one right, right okay, in my backyard. Here hey, here we go. Story. Story on Angel toxicosis. I see. Let's rest here for today. <laughs> you oh, guessed right. it. She can't speak. Uh. Oh boy. Oh. Yeah. What's wrong? Oh. Boy? I would assume she's lost her voice. What? <laughs> why? Why would they do this? They fun, they had budget fact, cuts on the voice actors. Fun fact: One of my favorite Let's Players did did a Everyone, parody of the scene, and I love it so much. See, it, you've seen it. Mhm. Mm what does it say? I'll, I'll share it afterwards. Okay. okay. But everyone pay attention, this is actually important story shit that's going to be coming up soon. No. Oh. Okay. Alright. Huh? Keep your eyes to peeled. I want to explain to everyone why I was trying to assassinate the Chosen. Also, right, this area used listen. to be more bluer. Tell us about your homeland. A land that doesn't exist in this world. In fact, when I saw the video, I thought they were in a desert. You knew? Mm. No. But you said it yourself that Silveront will be saved. That must mean you aren't from Silveront. Yeah. You know, it's really a shame that your intellect's being wasted here. You're right. My homeland is not here. Not in Silveront. What does that mean? My world is called Tetheala. Tetheala? You mean the moon? <laughs> of course not. My world isn't on the moon. Look at that J. Look at that 2D J. I really movement. don't understand the specifics, but there's another world that lies entwined with Silverant. A shadow is to light. That's Tetheala, my world. Two mm. entwined. The two worlds lie directly the adjacent to each other. They just can't see one another. Our scholars say they exist. The mirror in world dimensions. from Kirby. The dark, mm. the dark world from the Metroid Prime Two Echo. Or touch each other. But they do, <clears throat> in fact, exist next to and affect each other. What do you mean, affect each other? They vie for the supply of mana. When one world weakens, the mana from that world flows to the other. As a result, one world is always flourishing, and the other waning. Sort of like an hourglass. Wait, so right now Silverond is... Yeah. Silverond's mana is flowing to Tetheala. Therefore, Silverant is in decline. Without mana, crops won't grow and magic becomes unusable. If there's no mana, the summoned spirits that protect the world alongside the goddess Martel can't survive in Silverant either. As a result, the world slips even further down the path of destruction. Then the Chosen's world regeneration is actually the process of reversing the mana flow? Exactly. When the Chosen breaks a seal, the mana flow reverses and the summoned spirit that governs the seal awakens. I was sent to prevent the world regeneration from happening. I broke through the supposedly impassable dimensional fissure for the sake of protecting Tetheala. How? In other words, to assure the decline and destruction of Silveron? You can say that, but your journey of regeneration is also an attempt to destroy Tetheala. We're both doing the same thing. It's hard for me to believe all of this. I'm the proof. I possess summoning arts that have been lost from this world. Please don't look at me like that, Colette. I know that wasn't your intention. I don't know what I should do either. I came here to protect Tetheala, but this world is impoverished and everyone is suffering. But if I allow the world regeneration to occur, then Tetheala will become just like this. But right now you're helping us, right? Yes, but that doesn't mean I can just abandon Tetheala. I, I don't know what to do. Isn't there any other way? A way for Silveront, Tetheala, and Colette to all be happy? I want to know too. Have you considered that perhaps nothing that convenient exists in the real world? Yes, in the real world where right mon monsters where monsters and magic crisis. exist. What if we don't regenerate the world? Really we just realistic. Science. Although we succeed in destroying a ranch, we cannot possibly eliminate all the designs. In the manor, if we can force, we can exhaust it. We can force them into hiding. Really that important? 
I suppose only magic users and scholars worry about it. But mana is even more important to life than water. Without it, the land will die. Mana is the source material which composes everything. At least that's what I've been taught. Unfortunately, the giant tree of ever-flowing mana in... We live by chipping away at the limited amount of available mana. Why do you think the ancient Magi technology was lost? Because mana disappeared from the world. Correct. Magi technology consumes large amounts of mana. If things continue the way they are now, Silverant will eventually lose its mana, just as it lost its Magi technology and be destroyed. Colette? R... E... M... I? Ah, you're trying to spell something, right? I'll try asking Remiel if there's a way to save the two worlds. If it doesn't Just bring out, some pen and paper. I may have to kill you after all. Sheena! When that time comes I may fight back because I love Silverant too. I understand. You intend to become an angel no matter what, don't you? E eh. Um, mm -hmm. how do you exactly write on Lloyd's hands? You just do. Probably chasing up letters. Okay, so here's a thing. Yeah, just there is left. actually a side, a side thing we can do now that will make certain a thing easier in the future. So we're Your going to do that to close out the stream. <laughs> so there's two worlds. One that is suffering and the other that is flourishing and because Silveron is right now it's withering its mana is withering away that's why the world regeneration was for to regenerate all the mana that was in Silveron but in doing so Sefeala also loses its mana and vice versa yes that is one purpose of the world regeneration. It also has another purpose you'll be finding about very shortly, but that is one purpose. Well, it's one, but it's very important if you want to understand the story. So essentially, Silveron and Tefe Allen kind of have a parasitic relationship to each other right now. Yeah, and they can't, yeah. see, can't see each other. Goodness. They can't even email. They can't even email because Tefiala lost the magic technology to write emails. No, Trying this slurp that thing. life force. Anyway, this is the side shit. What is the side shit? It's a unicorn, <clears throat> but it's under the sea. Darling, oh, wetter, down where it's wetter. Take it from me. You learn about the everything Sheena can do. Undyne. Un so you're telling me Undyne. that Undyne, Undyne <laughs> isn't just an Undertale character? No. No. She's known it's as a Undine. And it's Undine. Yeah, Undine. Which is, I mentioned it earlier. I mean, I think it was in a past stream. So I'm put a flashback in here. The best stream. Teach me the ways of the Undine. So we're basically going to go and break the seal of water so that she could summon Undine. Boy's bad habit. 
I have a bad habit of making bad habits. <clears throat> I have a bad yeah. habit of, uh... Eating frozen patties. The bad habit of bad habits. The seven... The seven highly effective bad habits of Lloyd Irving. <laughs> Lloyd does get bored with everything way too easily, that is true. Oh, wait, you need to stop eating frozen patties! You're gonna get tapering that way! I don't care! I, I need to become everyone's stronger! I just like it how everyone's telling each other to shut the fuck up. I need the, I need the extra nutrition! I need okay, the tapeworm! We're going to be riding the dogmobile to the sea of water. You mean, you mean, you mean riding your pillow? Away! Yeah. How the mute? Element. Because this is going to be quite the walk. I can't tell. I really can't tell. It just seems like going at the same speed. Hmm. Lloyd on his way to go hunt down an Anjana. <laughs> Crossover between a Tales of. A Tales of Game and a Monster Hunter game would have been really interesting. This is gonna be and, I, and I don't mean like, uh, and I don't mean like a crossover with an existing Tales of Game. I mean like its own original game crossed over with Monster Hunter stuff. Well, I was thinking more so like, like you know, like a collab where you get items from the game from the games and stuff. I kind of wish game companies would do more crossover games. Like, yeah, they're nice. Like, if Project Crossbone yeah. and Mario, Mario and Rabbit can have sequels, then I don't see why something like that can't happen. <laughs> it's like, it's like companies need to ask for licenses and stuff. And then they have to negotiate about which characters are gonna appear, etc, cetera, etc, cetera, and what the story's all about. But more so licensing. And I guess copyright too. The way I see it, if you're like gonna do a crossover game of Monster Hunter Tales, have it play out like Tales of Berseria. But have like the elements of Monster Hunter where you can like you can like sever different parts of its body just like you do just like you do in Monster Hunter. Mm, or maybe the break yeah. system from Arise. Be because in Tales of Arise there are some boss monsters that have a weak point and if you smash that weak point and if you smash that weak point, the enemy becomes stunned. I think that will also work for Monster Hunter 2. Or they just... Well, actually, no. It could, still... it could be a good thing. Yeah, it would. It would be a good thing. And let's not also forget Mario and Sonic at the Olympic Games. Because we're never gonna get a proper Mario and Sonic crossover. I mean, we kinda had in Smash Brothers. Yeah, but I mean like... Smash I mean, Bros. I mean like a whole game based around Mario and Sonic teaming up. Well, it would have been nice. Actually, I you know what? It would, be, I w it would be like an RPG. Like a cross between Super Mario RPG and... Uh... A better version, a better and more polished version of Sonic Chronicles. I have a feeling that several other games... That, I have a feeling that that's been done by several... By several... By several fans. I think there's like multiple fan games where it's an RPG with Mario and Sonic characters. Hmm. 
Like, there has to be one somewhere. Green. I mean, don't you guys remember Super Mario Brother Z? I remember Super Mario Brother Z. I, I do. Go, Rain. Why don't you rain tears? Your name is Rain. Rain. Rain these nuts. Rain, rain, go away. Cry again another day. I'm gonna go rain on your parade. Which is ironic because it's actually raining right now. Now it's raining on Cherry's yeah. parade. Cherry's parade has been rained. Setting the stage for a hero's Heroes parade. Lloyd he we're fucking back here. Irving Heroes. Ugh. We're back uh. in this godforsaken dump. What do you mean it's a dump? It's full of water. It's a water dump. Is it filled with thankfully we don't have to do the puzzle again? It should still be open. Are you sure? Sheena Good. Sheena's afraid of failure. <laughs> yes, I under I understand that FYE is a better is a better place to buy really cool stuff compared to like I'm a piece to like you. Compared to like I can't think of any other compared to like comics and stuff. Not much of a it, for real though, FYE is a really cool store. They they sell like vinyl atlas. They sell like vinyl for your music player. Oh, music. I have one of those near you too. Uh -huh. I'll be right back. But the only one that we have is located in the other part of town. That's where I got the Reptar candy bar. The one that I said was really sugary. Okay, yep, it's still open. Here we go. You weren't scared about trying to kill us. Why are you scared about this now? It is I, the Sunny. You who possess the right of the pact. The I am fun. one who is bound to the Sunny. Us. What is your name? Mythos? The hero of the Carlon War? Not only was Mythos a swordsman, he had the ability to summon as well? Mythos is a common boy's name. It's not necessarily Mythos the hero. I don't know where you're from, but it's sure ain't here! I am Sheena. I seek a pact with Undini. As things mm -hmm. stand now, I cannot. Wh why I am already bound by a pact. I cannot form two packs at the same time. You mean you're packed with that Mythos guy? What am I supposed to do now? They never said anything about this at the Research Institute. Uh... Huh. Well, can't you just get her to cancel the old pact? How? We don't even have any idea where this Mythos person is. A Summon Spirit Pact requires a vow. As long as the Pact Maker upholds that vow, the Pact remains valid. That is correct. I know about that. <clears throat> the Summon Spirit approves the Pact Maker's vow and agrees to the Pact. Exactly. Pact is backed. Therefore, all you need to do is follow Lloyd's advice and request the annulment of the previous Pact. And form a new would, would you follow Lloyd's advice, it's Shuri? The previous pact maker has broken his vow. <laughs> Lloyd's advice and Boy, what? They have already passed away. Anything. Depends. Is it really it that depends. simple? It depends. I suppose you could call it simple. 
But if the what if Lloyd's most fantastic pieces of advice is, remember, licking doorknobs is illegal in other kingdoms. Okay, I'll give it a shot. Undini, I am Sheena. I ask that thou annulst thy pact with Mythos and establish I am back pact. I am back it. Before I come back, back Undini, have a new pact. Yep. I must test your worthiness as a pact maker. Draw your weapons. What? We have to fight? Let it yes. begin. Yes. Unite to fight. I shall judge your world. Dare to fight the night. Dare to fight the night. I do like like this battle. It plays, a, it plays every time we fight a summon. Wait, is this fighting up the spirit? Yeah, yep. this is fighting to the spirit. Oh, my favorite, one of my favorite seal songs. Ready? Do 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 Wait. Now here comes the best part, watch. Take a listen. Wait, holy shit, I've heard this song before. But it was not from this game. Well, it is now. Well, now you know where it's from. It hurt this game in a Mar in this Mario World ROM hack called Call of Cthulhu, and it plays during the final boss against Cthulhu. What? Wait, why so is that song plays on the final Cthulhu. boss? Yeah. Why is because that everyone, Cthulhu? because this song goes hard. Okay, but why is it on Call of Cthulhu? It's a, it's a, to be fair, it's a pretty impressive hack. I tried looking for the hack, but Thanks. it's no longer available. Like I also heard, I also listened to some of the remixes that also go even harder. I am impressed. Not bad, am I? Blah! <laughs> She she vomits as she dies. Now swear your vow. She vomits out of steel. Upon what vow do you form our pact? Right now, at this very moment, there are people who are suffering. I vow to save those people. Understood. I pledge my power to.